With the Zmodeler brush selected, hover over a poly and press spacebar to open up the Zmodeler poly menu. Locate the Spherize action. With the Spherize action selected, you'll see a series of targets in which the action can be applied. Let's select the target All Polygons. With the All Polygons modifier selected, simply clicking on any polygon on your model and clicking and dragging will start applying a spherical deformation. This action can be applied multiple times to start converting your model into a perfect sphere. Another set of targets that work really well with the Spherize action are the targets of Flat Border and Flat Inner. With the Flat Border target selected, if I come across any polys on a flat area of a mesh and simply click and drag, you will notice that the outer edges of that flat area are now being spherized and turning into a circle. If I undo this process again and now select the target of Flat Inner and now apply the process to my mesh, you will notice that the inner edges of the inner polys are now being deformed. This process is really nice when trying to generate holes using the QMesh action. So using this process to spherize, you can come across and locate different areas on your model and spherize them to change geometry in areas to add different features and forms.